Drops you right into the gameplay. I'm sorry, I'm gonna do some advertisement first before I actually play legitimately. Um, welcome back, everyone. This is Dark Science from Dark Science Reviews. Today we are going to stream Sky Force Anniversary. Now, if you haven't heard of Sky Force Anniversary, General it's currently one of the best uh, shoot 'em ups, I believe, on uh, PC as of right now. It's gotten 10 out of 10, 9 out of 10. It's basically a pretty nut kind of game. Um, Sky Force Anniversary is a shoot 'em up, kind of like uh, an old school 1942. I don't know if everybody remembers that back in the Nintendo days, but they have a lot of really cool games that are kind of similar to it. I didn't expect it to just toss me in there. I, I threw me off a little bit. I apologize every <laughs> time. Uh, but for the most part, we're going to be streaming this game today. want to give an update on my Twitch here to make sure everybody knows that I'm live. I know I just said I was only gonna take a few minutes but I got thrown off a little tiny bit anywho Skyforce anniversary is by developer infinite dreams and crunching koalas I don't know if there's a slash in between there or whatnot but there's a slash in between there uh, but for the most part I think it's infinite dreams for sure now the Crunchy Koalas, I don't know why it's on there, but it definitely is on there. I don't know if it's uh, a subsidiary or whatnot. I'll have to ask later on whether or not it is. I'd like to give a shout out to Merrick for the review and stream opportunity. We are going to be playing for quite a bit of time here. Let's set it for about an hour. And then uh, we got a lot of stuff to unveil today, a lot of reviews coming out, a lot of craziness today. It's very, very busy on a Friday for me. I, I would like to get it very busy on a Friday because Saturday and Sunday I like to get, take a, like, a really long break and just kind of game for fun. High scores are like for right now. Oh, it looks like Stallion's up there. Carnage. If we beat Carnage, we're gonna throw down, man. All right, let's get into some of this gameplay. What do the options have for us? English, language mostly, sound, music, credits. Now, I haven't played a shoot 'em up in a bit, so this will be my first one. So, what better game to get into than uh, one of a highly critically acclaimed appraised game? Let's see, stage one, I guess these are extra little. Uh, Medals you can do destroy 70% of enemy forces, 100%, and rescue all people, and then stay untouched. Oh wow! Let's read off those achievements real fast. I guarantee there's gonna be some hard ones. Uh, destroy, destroy, destroy! Rescue, rescue, rescue! Earn 10 medals, 50 medals, 100 medals. Collect a thousand stars, 5,000, 20,000. Bang! VIPs, three different power-ups in a single game, save five power-ups until the end of the stage, ram through the en enemy wave with your energy shield, destroy at least 15 enemies with the same mega bomb. Actually, they don't look too bad, but let's start earning some to actually really gauge. Should begin. Here's 
your new plane. I like the graphics already. They kind of pop. And it looks like there's two player. Uh, two player local co op. All they need to do is press start. So that's pretty nice. 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 I like uh, I like the backgrounds as well. Definitely pop out. So many of these uh, games usually like I swear to you, like you make your eyes go in like twelve different places at once. But this one's kind of easy on the eyes. Easy on the eyes. I was getting mad because I didn't save him. I missed somebody. Oh, so you just have to like hover over them to save them. Weapon upgrade. Weapon upgrade. This guy is getting pissed. He's like, you're not gonna save me. I'm out of damn rock. Weapon upgrade. Done. How's this ship still going, man? It has like, like half of the chunks are out of it. I'm pretty sure I messed up its uh, navigation by now. You're built like ridiculous. Give me your star.
125 stars have been collected. Rescued everybody. I destroyed 88% of enemies. So, how many challenges did I get there? Oh no, I'm at the bottom of the list. I'll have to come back. I like that they let you come back and just upgrade this stuff. Obviously, you gotta bank quite a few points. But once you get a roll on, it doesn't matter. I wonder how they got better scores. They went back that after they were dance. upgraded. Gee. If I had some really fast guns and stuff, I think I would get 100% too. Weapon upgrade. Weapon upgrade. Nice. Uh oh. Weapon upgrade. Hit right. Weapon upgrade. Weapon upgrade. Chain lost. My chain. I like how they get mad if you don't rescue them. They're like on an island. Probably like, come on, keep me on this island. You don't rescue me. Okay. I wish it was this fast all the time. Oh, I like this game a lot, actually. I can say that I might get some of And everybody knows what happens when Dark Science gets big with the games. It goes on like 12 hour marathon streams. No apparent reason. Get him? Did I rescue him? I left him on the island. My chat is open for anybody. I'll look over as often as I can. Apologize if I can't get you right away. Just shoot him up, so. Gotta veer off left and right to check the chat log. But, like I tell everybody, if you want to just come in and want to check out what the is all about, that's totally fine as well. Um, Skyforce Anniversary is currently available on the Xbox Live Marketplace for anybody who likes what they see. Critically acclaimed game as of right now, and I can see why already. Yeah, I have two ships to fight.
it's not too hard as of right now, but I am going to get some stages. I'm pretty sure it's going to get good. Possibly, uh... Possibly bullet hell. Don't know for sure yet. Won't be that far. Can't judge it yet. But I'm definitely liking the graphics and how it looks. It's smooth, man. Look at this. I've always had like a little bit of uh, lag or something in some of these games. Oh, Xbox One. But this one's fine. Love it. Probably one of the best shoot 'em ups I've played. Collected 219 stars. When did they have like some type of star magnet that you can unlock later or something? Oh, I just smoked somebody. I am number five. Remember, if we beat Carnage's score live on stream, we are going to tell him we beat him. Requires one additional medal. I'll just go back to the first one. Destroy 100% of enemies and stay untouched. Second one. Destroy 100% of enemies, rescue all people, and stay untouched. Mission begins. Try this stage. Uh, it goes by medals, which is pretty cool, I guess. It's no wonder you have to go back to a couple stages just to unlock some of those medals. Now I see where they got them scores from. Weapon upgrade. Nice. nice. Weapon upgrade. Weapon upgrade. Oh no. Almost missed him. But I didn't get the untouched. Weapon upgrade. That is a shame. I didn't get that one, so now I have to literally 100% focus on killing all the enemies. Oh yeah, there's there's no achievement pop as of yet for me yet, but I'm sure we'll get quite a few towards the end of it. Weapon upgrade. I literally try to crash into them just so I don't miss them. I already missed too many though. Weapon 
weapon upgrade. And it's game over. Game over. Okay, let us progress to the second stage and try and rescue all people. Mission begins. Oh, damn. It's on, Carnage. Get ready. He's <laughs> got like 41,000 stars. He's the second place. I'm definitely going to be. Just like that. One thing I do say, I will say this, is like, I wish you could keep your upgrades all the way through rather than uh, be progressive during the stage. But I guess it kind of mixes in a little bit of a uh, challenge as well. I just demolished right there at the end. Stock up some points here. Mission begins. I'm gonna stock up the 500 so I can get the magnet. I do want the missiles too, but I just can't be choosers. Mission begins.
more upgrade to go here. have been rescued. Stage complete. Why do they call them humans? Does that mean that you're an alien? Or is it just calling them humans because it's computer AI actually answering? Alright, stage 3 has been unlocked. Do have enough for it? No, not yet. 
this one. Percent, 70 percent. So we're gonna focus on the 70 percent and the rescue all. The stay on touch is gonna be a little tough to do. Seven percent. Oh no. Health restored. Nice. It's definitely getting tougher. If I had some type of uh, super bombs right here, I would have used them for sure because I missed too many. <laughs> but my main focus was uh, all people and about 75% of enemies. So I don't know if I'll get 75 now. Missed quite a few there. Critical condition. Health restore. Health restore. Health restore. Be mad. Human rescued. Weapon initiated. It's General Mattis and his flying fortress. Show him where he belongs. He belongs in the ocean. I will bring you no. like a toothpick. Oh, 
Oh no. Game over. Okay. Should have enough for an upgrade or two here. Saving up. Mission begins. Now we just gotta actually beat it legitimately. Already rescued enough uh, people, so I got that challenge completed. We just gotta focus on staying alive and getting upgrades. 75% of the enemies. Get what we get. Nice. Nice. Weapon Got an achievement pop there. Need more than that. Destroy a thousand enemies already. Great, great, great. Rescued. 
Star banking is definitely a thing in this game. Use General Magnus at his flying fortress. Show him where he belongs. Okay. Boss time. I will break you nice. like a bit. Three hundred and seven stars collected. In Working my way up those leaderboards. Four health main cannon. Missiles or lasers yet, so I do wonder about that. Again, probably does. One metal. You have to actually go in untouched or something. Alright, well let's see how we fare on this one. Either we get 100% of enemies or we go in untouched. Chances are I'm not going to do it. But we can bank up stars. And, uh, that's probably the main thing that's going to help a bit. The stars. Nice. nice. Weapon upgrade. All our fire on the enemies. Good, good, good. Weapon upgrade. Figure if you uh know the level good enough. Ships. Human rescued. 
far we're at 100% right now of all enemies killed, so I gotta really crash into them if I have to. Weapon upgrade. So far, so good. Kill and rescue. Come on, give me the hundred percent. Yes. After you upgrade quite a bit, it shouldn't be too hard. You start doing the stages by heart. And there's that highlight. Five medals. So it's actually gonna take some time to get through each stage. They make you go back, double back, and get 100% on everything, so it's a little bit challenging. Once you upgrade everything, though, I figure it gets easier and easier as you progress. Alright, we don't have too much longer here, so. Kill and rescue. We'll probably be able to do another stage or two, possibly. Weapon upgrade. And, uh... We'll come nice, back nice. to it. Weapon upgrade. At a later date. Everybody wondering, I will be making these highlights later on for a later too. Nice. Check out the game, see if you like it, etc. etc. Uh, and possibly upload, upload it to YouTube. I know a lot of uh, you've been asking me to upload some more to YouTube as well, so I'll definitely do that. So for all you watching later, I hope you enjoy it. Great game so far, I'm liking it a lot. I like how the graphics pop. Have that uh, effect on you where most of these games usually do, where like you start getting that motion blur sickness or whatever, move it around so much. That's mostly them bullet hell games, though. This one's like a little bit more laid back. Thank 
I like that it actually lets you take some of the stuff with you though. Better watch them scores. Take it. I guess I'll save up for missiles and lasers. So the stages are definitely getting more challenging. Loving the graphics, uh, it's smooth. Look at that water. Look at them trees. Human rescue. Weapon upgrade. Yes, basically you aim for one thing at a time. I think that's bad. Your beast you go for all three things at a time, but take your time. You should be able to get everything. You'd have to replay these levels so many times, anyways. There always, there seems to be a boss at every, at, at the end of every stage. So, nice. that one all together and I have to I get to the 85% of 
side for Sam and the uh, rest of the ball. I'm dead. Game over. Got two challenges completed though, even though I lost, so that's good. We'll do one more and then we're gonna wrap it up. How much do I have? Pistols are next, so we'll definitely unlock it. We'll do stage two and try and get 100% of all enemies.
Now you start to get so focused on this when you're actually aiming for like one of the little uh, metal goals. You like get into a trance there. Unfortunately, I don't have any of those. A token of gratitude. Okay, rescue 100 people. Next achievement has been unlocked. Two so far. Going into overtime mode. Play Skyrim instead. I actually did actually uh, play Skyrim for a while. If you check out my highlights, I remember I streamed uh, the new Skyrim remastered for about maybe two hours, three hours. I got kind of lost in the game. You know what happens in Skyrim. You try and go and do something. Next thing you know, you're on top of a mountain, swimming around. You don't know why. And then somehow you're in like a cult. <laughs> but I definitely do gotta get back to Skyrim. A couple people have already asked me about that. I will be getting back to it, no worries. We are going into overtime mode here. Probably play until we get past stage four for sure. Now I'm saving up for the lasers, I think. It's gonna cost a thousand stars. Energy shield and the mega bomb. Probably the mega bomb is what I really need to focus on getting. We'll get everything eventually. A lot of the 100% are a little tough. Three more medals to go. This one's untouched now. Try stage 2 one more time for the 100%. Missiles auto launch. Yeah, that missile's definitely gonna help a little bit. 
especially since it's homing and does more damage Good. than, uh... There just to take him out. Not getting the untouched on this one for sure. I had the Mega Bomb, I think that that's the game. I don't know what the laser is. Hopefully, uh, they're as cool as they sound. Good so far. Uh, it looks like a good majority of the achievements are accumulated, so you're gonna get at least half of them just by play naturally. Play for an hour or so and you get uh start popping them left and right. I think it's uh everything's gonna be like about three to five hour mark if you on uh, how good you do in the levels. Excellent. 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 For anybody who's following on my Twitter as well, I did uh, recently stream another game earlier today and uh, I got a couple more coming at me today, so stay tuned for quite a bit. I might even be moving over to the PlayStation for another stream as well. We'll see what happens there if I have enough time for all that. I wish I had all these upgrades at the beginning. there so that's another metal yeah 100 percent uh, 304 we got another achievement pop there medal of honor and 10 medals in total we are at 304 I think I'm gonna save up for the lasers and then I'll start upgrading everything later. Two medals to go. Try 
Species 3. Try and get 100% on here. Out of the first two stages, everything kind of gets a little harder, so... I don't expect to get this my first attempt. Yeah, there we go. Well, 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 Weapon upgrade. Human rescue. Weapon upgrade. Human rescue. Help rescue restored. Good, good, good. Weapon upgrade. Um. because I'm doing pretty good right now. Unfortunate that I missed that one. At least I think I missed him. Unless the missile got him and I didn't see. Health restored. Health restored. Great, great, great. If you time that perfectly, you can get everything right here. Got him there. I had the Mega Bomb, maybe.
how hard it was the first time. Upgrades definitely make a big difference in this game. back to stage four unless I'm gonna attempt not getting hit on stage one which will actually be a little bit tough I'll try one not getting Mission hit begins. run here hopefully I can get it the first time if I don't then you know it is what it is this one I don't have to focus on getting anything except for dodging their bullets and stuff whatever I get I get Wait a good majority of the bullets that they send my way. Nice. Weapon upgrade. Weapon upgrade. Weapon upgrade. Missiles are auto, I think. So I don't even need to shoot them, they just automatically launch at a random interval. Good, good, good. Weapon upgrade. Human rescued. Weapon upgrade. Human rescued. Got it. No hits whatsoever.
one more medal. Oh, there's extra medals? Oh, what? Hard mode unlocks after you unlock all the medals. Kidding me? Let's try begins. hard mode. Now I have to see how is the hard mode on the first stage. Get nuts. How crazy it gets. Weapon upgrade. Nice. nice. It doesn't seem too much harder. I wonder if it's just the damage that they do to you that's different. Because I seem to be taking them out about the same. But then again, it is the first stage. Good. 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 Damage just for one hit. Probably like two hits and then you're dead. stars but does more damage Stage basically eight. just keep up the don't get hit and maybe you'll be able to get it they take a little bit more damage the bosses two there thousand That is crazy. So there's there's uh, a hard difficulty per stage, so it kind of mixes it up a little bit. Okay. 
that uh, I guess I actually have to stage 4 to progress to stage 5. We'll do this last stage and then uh, unlock the next stage and then see where we go from there. Okay, there's a laser. Laser and I guess a pinch or something. Nice. It's definitely getting more interesting with the better weapons. Let myself get hit there. I don't know what Weapon upgrade. Good, good, good. Dark Silence is getting addicted to a game. It might turn into a very long stream. Nice. But uh, I said I would. I gotta cover some other stuff today, so we gotta actually move forward. <laughs> I don't know if anybody was watching when I was streaming It'll Do. That thing turned into like a nine hour plus marathon. Don't even get me started on the first time I played Final Fantasy XV. Like a freaking 12 hours. Uh, if anybody is uh, into Final Fantasy as well, I got the Adam Antoy's fight. Although it wasn't the best fight scene, uh, it did take me a little bit of time to get down uh, Adam Antoy's. For Adamantos, however you want to pronounce it. Oh no. Don't die on me. Good, good, good. No. said we would beat that stage. We're going to beat it. This time I'm going to use the laser. Screw it. Definitely use against those uh, enemies that I don't like very much. The ones that launch off the little balls. Directions. Those guys are not very fun. Nice, nice. Oh, we got an achievement there. Two thousand five enemies have been destroyed. How do you do that? Some more upgrades. Nice. Sure. 
and rescued. Weapon upgrade. Chain lost. Kill and rescued. Kill and rescued. Help restore. Dodge them. took my eyes Game off over. for a millisecond. So far we have 4 of 26 achievements, 90 gamer score in total. Eight in progress. It'll more than likely be popping. Not too bad. Not too bad. I'm gonna try the tournament stage real fast. Nice. 
Randomly, but dang, they hit me pretty hard right there. Well, I did pretty horrible in that tournament. They give you 62 hours, though. Plenty of time to upgrade your ships and stuff. There's a hard mode. Now, I don't know if it stops at about stage 9 or not, but. We made it about stage four and made it up to hard mode on stage one. We got to call it here, guys. I apologize. Uh, I'll be up with something else in a, a few minutes. Hopefully, uh, uh, maybe, maybe 10, 15 minutes to get some food or something and then hop back on. Uh, Sky Skyforce Anniversary is currently available on the Xbox Live Marketplace. If you like what you've seen, uh, please like, share, follow, and subscribe if you enjoyed this stream. I uh, also have a YouTube and Twitch channel. Uh, basically, you can find me on both of them. It'll be Dark Space Silent Space Reviews uh, to get all my updates and uh, some of my uploads. Sometimes I upload a little bit of the stream to YouTube here and there. I'd like to give a shout out to Merrick for the stream review opportunity. I'll be updating my Twitter and my Twitch in a few moments uh, to let everybody know when I'll be streaming the next game and when I decide which game it's going to be. Uh, if you haven't caught my highlights, I actually stream quite a bit this week. Uh, go ahead and uh, check them out if you're really feeling it. all three of these games that I stream today or more basically I might be streaming at least five today it just depends on how everything goes and how much time I have we're making some pretty good time although I got a little bit addicted of the on this game once again Skyforce anniversary is by developer infinite dreams uh, slash crunching koalas I don't know if it's subsidiary or whatnot but I definitely will check that later on thank you all for watching and I hope you enjoyed it Happy gaming, everyone, and I'll be back in a bit with another game. Uh, live on Twitch in hopefully, let's say 15 minutes. I'll see you all then.